this week for look of the week we're not gonna do my usual thing where i shout the girls out we're gonna cover the couture show by pierre moss um designed by kirby jean raymond the great you know the talented and i believe that this is his first couture offering if you know anything about fashion couture it's a very very big deal I recommend you watch The Secret World of Haute Couture on YouTube. It was like a BBC special and it'll kind of like give you a little bit more insight into what this is and why it's so important and why it's so important and monumental for a black designer to be showing here as well. So, Pure Moss, I saw a bunch of coverage from the different creatives and, you know, girls and guys I follow on Twitter and Instagram that like there was a bus and people were picked up and like weed was passed out. Um, it was very chic. It rained, but, you know, the people powered through it and they sat for the look and the looks were worth it. So it starts off with this, like, candy cookie type look. And it says, uh, delicious and refreshing. And then it has pure moss on there. Very cute look. Don't really know what to say. And then don't judge this by, like, its wearability. Couture is supposed to be, like, fantastic and you know otherworldly so don't look at this like oh that's not functional or we can't that's not what we're here for this stuff is super expensive it's to make a moment then we have the curtain look there is a lot of kitsch and a lot of camp in this show so also don't be discouraged by that but this is like you know people have those fancy curtains in their house with the well it's a window treatment let me correct myself my mom would be disgusted people have the fancy window treatments in their home and they may have you know the sconces the poles the tassels on the side and that's what this look is giving everything matches head to toe even the shoes are you know fashioned out of this same window treatment fabric headpiece as well this next look i love it it is like sexy superhero sexy dystopian she's got the mask on with the one eye she has gas mask type of belt love the lace up shoe i live for a lace up shoe and this one was actually done appropriately because i have some that i cannot even wear out because they're just heels with strings on them and there's nowhere to put your foot there's no type of traction and this one has a front strap a top mid foot strap and then the sexy straps that go all the way up the leg give us more of this and less of the other help us out then we have the pure moss peanut butter very cute again same strappy shoes i want those shoes the black ones are cute this orange or red look this is also cute i want it this is very angel black marie antoinette um horseshoe with gold the sexy shoe again in the blue so i want this in all the colors i love the bustle you know on the sides i'm a costume girl but then it's like very club at the top so i'm interested to see one of the rap girls or the pop girls pull off one of these looks like this type of look in their video because it's very avant-garde the gold the gold is a regular look if not for the headpiece because you can wear this gold out right now day night but the headpiece is what makes it couture it's the elevation and the gold shoes again i'm gonna have a comment about these shoes every time i see them because they're fat girl ice cream look now i showed this this look to my mom she bust out laughing but she is not a couture connoisseur okay my mom is more about wearability functionality but this ice cream look did it for me i love the pants initially when i first saw it i didn't see the shoe so i thought it was a boot i would have loved that even more but here we are the pants are cute and we got the white shoe and the ice cream top now again i would love to see one of the rap girls, one of the pop girls with this ice cream top. It is very Katy Perry, California girls. I like this. Then we have Aoki Lee Simmons in her, this might be her Paris debut. She might have showed that like some stuff with her mom, but this is like a job job. Get it Aoki and you're going to Harvard girl. Small clap for Aoki. She's out here killing it. I remember Aoki did not think she was bomb, did not think she was fine. All she thought was she was she was smart and she was trying to milk that smartness. And now we see that Harvard and modeling are not mutually exclusive. Aoki, give it to us, serve it to us. My chest, my heart. Okay, Aoki came to slay in the chess piece Queen's Gambit look with the 3D chess pieces. Mm, but she can't do it like me. This is hard. The shoes also tie it together nicely it's very fun it's very playful it's very fun and it's very playful the baby hairs i'm not mad at the hairstyle sets it off makeup i'm impressed we have the super soaker look now every black child from sea to shining sea has 
had the super soaker and know what this look is immediately i love the execution of it the blue shoes the orange hat the mc hammer type jacket it's just there it's all there for me music video gold movie gold next look is a hand a brown hand black hand holding this mop and it has very tailored pants the shoes match exactly i like this look it is a message to especially for a whole couture show because whole couture is all about like being very very glam and over the top and you know uh old hollywood and expensive because where else would you wear these expensive ass clothes so for him to play on like our heritage and where we come from and service work and all of that that is really and especially paying attention to american culture and american kitsch and that type of stuff we're a part of that americana we've been here the whole time so i love this we got the stoplight dress with the headpiece this is a doja cat look doja cat would kill this in a music video she my lord but again, without the top, if we put the top down, this is a regular club dress, you could wear this out. Then we have a typography look. It has a typewriter belt, the pants. It all looks silk. Very, very nice, very expensive fabric. And there are like paper leaflets. It is layered in a way to look as such professional top. And then the notes from the typewriter. Very cute, very creative. Just, I hope, I can't really see this up close and I'm sure I could watch a video and try to zoom in that the words are embroidered that would be bomb that would be fire and that would like make this piece to me more archival like you can put this in one of those big wedding dress frames in your house and like keep this in your Mariah Carey style closet the next look is what made me stop and be like oh there has to be some context to the show like I'm not getting the appropriate context I should be like googling this or diving deeper because it was like a random ass tint and i know that the flag is like the colors of pan-africanism and all that i'm a marcus garvey connoisseur but i was just like what does this mean and then so i google and i dig a little bit deeper and this show the whole show was about spotlighting african-american inventors like the set of the show the outdoor version was at madam cj walker's house and we all know madam cj walker what she's known for what she's famous for and then the villa is just a sign of that wealth and that you know triumph of the time because her wealth was way more than money it's like she's the first self-made one of the first self-made millionaires in the whole country then she's a black woman then she became that by you know like a mary Kay type business model where she's empowering other black women to do what she does on their level so it's just her be yicky of it a flag look the wave brush look i don't know what else to call this but you know those like boar bristle brushes and the back says pure moss and it's all like wood printed and even the front of the boots it is a look bomb then the brown leather look this is a super rihanna look from the front side of you like bucket hat brown leather bustier cool skirt exact matching boots i'm here for the full match look and i hate a matchy matchy like i give my grandma such a hard time about it but the whole my boot or my shoe is the same exact fabric as my outfit that does something to me mentally and i really 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 like that this look will be saved for me i want to emulate something my color of choice is black that's why we have on black today you know least ourselves be judged when we're talking about fashion but just this look is the one for me then there's the bicycle look which is very hot i would love to see if we had a black figure skater like how we got simone biles if we had a black michelle kwan i would want to see her in this look shut it down we have a one shoulder you can see like a mesh corset bustier type thing underneath red skirt love the detail at the top with the cut off and the cut out i just this is bomb this is more like red carpet you can get away with this uh film festival you can get away with this it's elegant we have the fire escape look this is bomb this is very couture very costume uh the only complaint i would have about this is the shoes because so far the shoes have been very on point and very like perfectly matched so i don't know what happened here but other than that very cool look the all black you know i live for all black that is my personal aesthetic this is cute love the like 
fringe long on the side this is definitely a red carpet look for a woman of a certain age it will elevate her it will make her look very sexy and futuristic golden chair look very very structural avant-garde she, she got a chair coming out of her but besides that the outfit looks very very wearable so i don't know if this chair is a harness it looks like it like it might be attached to the necklace other than that bomb like if you can detach this chair this is a look we got the cell phone look the brick phone look again this looks like an attachment other than that the dress is very sexy and very cute but if you want to shut down a halloween party like no one has ever done before and keep them social distance away from you this is the look for you girl because you can do something cute with the hair like she did baby hairs and all of that and be like oh no, no no don't talk to me i'm on the phone oh no, no don't come over here i'm on the phone i, I gotta take a call the ac in the window unit look with the yellow dress behind it again this is a piece the yellow dress behind it looks perfect looks flawless looks like 90s versace with the tailoring i love it but this air conditioned piece is hilarious because there is probably not a black soul in this country that has not lived in a house or been to a house that has ac hanging out the window like that the lamp look now this was one of the first looks i saw online of the show and it immediately was like oh i'm gonna cover that i gotta see the rest of the looks from that show what was that a lamp is that like my grandma's lamp turned into a dress with the rain down on me like sparkly eye perfect this look is bomb the roller look the roller look is all over social media and just wow because it's like a full fur coat type of thing made out of weave rolled up and from the notes and what i saw um with kirby these this is real hair and it took some months to put together because the girls were literally just wrapping the weave on the rollers i i live for it the casting is flawless as well fits so good and then she has the robe underneath it this is just I wish that there was a Broadway musical or something going on or like a very avant-garde like out there play so these clothes could be in them. I don't feel like they're going to get like their proper strut out in the world just being on the show. Like these clothes need to be out. They need lives. They need stories because they're just they're very big looks. The white refrigerator because as bougie as people try to get in these times again, many black people have have had we'll have in the future a white refrigerator with the magnets on it that's a, i grew up with the magnets on my fridge and these say but who invented black trauma and that's the last look of the show kirby i think you did an excellent job i'm so excited to see what you do in your ready to wear collections i always look forward to those i'm happy 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 be onwards to see you at couture and i hope that opens up more doors for people like us to be able to show on that level and be as creative and as openly black and unapologetic as you were with this collection. It was so fun. The creativity is on 100,000. I live for every moment of it. I love how you had your front row stack and you had Luxury Law there and the black people were out. I, I live for it. I'm so mad that it was open up to the public at the last minute and I couldn't like get my thoughts and myself together in time to fly out to New York and be there, but this is just incredible so thank you so so much for sharing yourself your talent your art with us i will be here next season waiting and watching and that's it for look of the week